what up youtube i'm back so it was a good one piece episode but i'm really excited for next week's episode because of what happened at the end of this week's episode you know so let's get right to it so obviously in the last few episodes luffy okiku and zoro have been trying to save otama because uh, she's been kidnapped by some of the beast pirates and they're still trying to save her you know so that's what we saw in this week's episode mostly but uh, i just want to say something and i've said that a lot uh, especially in last week's episode i think that in the last like two or three episodes the pacing of this arc has been really really bad you know before that it was great but right now the pacing has been bad in my opinion but that's just my opinion let me know in the comments down below what your thoughts about that another thing that i want to talk about is okiku and i've also said that in a lot of other episodes uh, she's a weird character man because even Zoro said in this week's episode that she's she kind of has an innocent act that she doesn't really need to do because she's pretty strong so even Zoro said stop with this innocent act you know because I don't know I don't know why she does that you know because she's pretty strong she doesn't let anybody do things to her you know so I'm wondering why she has this innocent act Hopefully we'll know what's going on with her very very soon but anyway I think Okiku, Okiku talked about that there's a place or some places where uh, you know um, the territory in Wano is really really good where there's good water good food and everything like that and we saw some of that territory in this week's episode it was at the end of Bakura town and I'm guessing that the villagers are working really really hard to make some food and everything like that harvest uh, uh, and all and what the beast pirates are doing is basically pay them a limited amount of money to for the food for the good food you know so that the beast pirates eat, eat, eat good but that the villagers eat kind of like poorly you know so that was kind of interesting we've talked about that in other episodes but seeing it uh, in this week's episode was eye-opening one of the beast pirate literally gave a little amount of money to one of the villagers and he couldn't even buy a uh, water or milk or something like that with that kind of money you know so that's that's crazy man the the things that is happening in wano right now because of kaido and his beast pirate plus uh, the new emperor it's crazy anyway we were introduced to a new character in this week's episode her name is speed obviously we've heard about her uh, a little bit earlier in other episodes and she's one of the headliners of bakura town obviously there's speed there's uh, captain arkins and then there's hold them you know so that's the three headliners for bakura town and in this week's episode was the first time that we encountered her she has uh, uh devil fruit power obviously but it's the horse mali fruit you know so that's that's weird like man these devil fruit powers from the the smiles factories are are crazy man it's getting out of hand you know <laughs> but it was pretty funny man how their devil fruit power works are really really funny because devil fruit power uh, was all some of them was already weird but the ones with the smiley the artificial devil fruit powers are even weirder you know so that makes me laugh a lot anyway like i said earlier in the review otama is still in the beast pirate possession and she's been through a lot man in the last few episodes first of all she she drank uh, poison water then she was kidnapped by the beast pirate that's crazy man and now she's in the mouth of hold them devil fruit power so so that's crazy man she's been through a lot but hopefully she'll be okay hopefully they'll be able to you know take her back because she like i said she's been through, through a lot but yeah <laughs> that that was kind of funny we saw luffy and hold them encounter each other for the first time but the thing that was interesting about it is that hold them thinks that uh, luffy zoro and okiku are doing all of that because of the thief that is named Shutenmaru or something like that that's pretty interesting we have not seen this character so far I think in this arc so he thinks that Luffy, Luffy is doing all of that because of Shutenmaru 
and we all know that he's not doing that for him he's doing that to take back otama you know so that was kind of interesting we all know that this guy is gonna come back in the story i don't know when but he's gonna come back in, in this arc you know so i'm wondering what kind of thief he is uh, maybe he's uh, you know taking food for the villagers i don't know but uh, he's gonna come back for sure it seems like Okiku knew what he was talking about because of her reaction right there, her facial reaction to uh, the name was pretty evident. So, so she knows who Shuten Maru is. So I'm wondering if we'll know uh, soon or, or if it will, uh, will we, if we will get back to that later in this arc. You know. So like I said, Okiku is a weird character to me right now. Her innocent act and the thing that that she knows you know it, it's she's an she's interesting but she's also weird so i think that, that there's still there's still a lot that we don't know about okiku so i can't wait to know what's going on with her but yeah man uh, the reason why i'm really excited for next week's episode is because is because the three headliners from bakura town are going to be there captain Hawkins, one of the the members of the same generation as uh, Luffy and Zoro, then there's Speed, and then there's Hold Them, you know, all of them is going to be in Bakura Town, uh, we saw La at the end of uh, the episode, so it's going to be amazing, but yeah, like I said, next week's episode I think is going to be incredible, Captain Hawkins, Hold Them, and Speed, the three headliners from the Beast Pirate, and then Zoro, Luffy, La, three members of, you know, the generation the, the special generation man i don't know i don't remember how how they're called i have a blank in my head my bad about that but uh, it's gonna be amazing obviously i'm gonna count okiku but she's not in the same kind of atmosphere you know when we're talking about power i guess at least uh, right now because we haven't seen a lot from okiku but i think it's gonna be a great episode man i can't wait to see it we still haven't seen uh, seen um law do something special in this arc uh he's just talking we haven't seen him done anything basically so hopefully we'll see him do something in next week's episode because he was kind of mad you know because the straw hats are not supposed to be that uh loud you know about them being in uh wano so it's gonna be interesting to see what's gonna happen in next week's episode let me know what you thought about this week's episode in the comments down below and let me know what you think is gonna happen next uh, i do one piece reviews every saturday so subscribe for that but i also do other anime related things like um black clover reviews on tuesdays i do dr stone and sometimes fire force reviews on uh, on friday sorry and i used to do kimetsu no yaiba demon slayer reviews on saturdays but it was uh, the last episode today of the season they're doing a movie though for the next arc so i can't wait for that there's four new shows coming to my channel the first one is uh, boruto naruto next generation they're doing a special arc for the 20th anniversary of the series it's gonna go to uh, october 6th i think to march so stay tuned for that there's also seven deadly sins the third season that is coming back uh, October 9th I think it's on a Wednesday so stay tuned for that I'm gonna review the entirety of the season and then there's Boku no Hero Academia season 4 uh, on October 12th that is a Saturday morning I think so I'm gonna also review the entirety of the season and the last anime is Sword Art Online Alicization War of Underworld I've reviewed uh, the first part of the, uh, the Alicization arc uh, in, the, in his entirety so I'm going to do the same thing for the second part so yeah man there's a lot coming to my channel this October so stay tuned for that uh, like comment subscribe it would help my channel a lot and follow me at anime specialist on twitter and instagram thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video anime specialist out peace